San Diego's newest city council member was sworn in by the first non-white person ever elected to the council. That I will support and defend. 95-year-old Tom Hom, who was elected in 1963 and later went on to the state assembly. The Constitution of the United States. Kent Lee will represent Council District 6 and says he's grateful and humbled by his new role. You know, many people have talked about this district being an Asian empowerment district uh, because it is 41 percent Asian American Pacific Islander and that's certainly not lost on me as well. I understand that that is a significant component of what this district um, has represented and I look forward to making sure that we carry those voices forward um, within the city. Uh, but really at the end of the day ensuring that we serve all of our residents within the city of San Diego and within the district. While the city council is nonpartisan, for the first time in city history, the council members are all Democrats. Chris Kate, who was termed out, was the only Republican on the council. And while the council itself looks quite different from when I first started, I found that it is possible to have differences in opinion with my colleagues and still find a way, and still find a way to deliver for this city. Also taking the oath of office on Monday, council members Jennifer Campbell, Monica Montgomery Stepp, and Vivian Moreno, who were all elected to second terms. Congratulations. Lee says he looks forward to joining the other incumbent council members and has his top priorities in order. Homelessness has grown to be a, a bigger challenge each and every day here in the city of San Diego. And what that also really means is that we must do something in terms of the actual housing that we can deliver uh, for San Diego residents so that people can live, play and enjoy working in San Diego. Um, and, and what's most important to that is that we need to ensure that there's housing that's going to be affordable for many of the middle income working families that we have throughout the city. The city council's leadership won't change this year. The council members voted unanimously to re-elect District 9's Shawnee Rivera as the council president. Jacob Ayer, KPBS News.